Hey guys, what's and welcome back to another Pixelmon guide here on the channel. As promised, today we got a double Pixelmon guide day going out for you guys. We are going to be showing off how to get the Eternal Flower Floet in your Pixelmon world. Yes, this is AZ's Floet. This is the legendary Immortal Floet that fought in the Great War, the Great Kalos War in Pokemon X and Y. Spoilers if you've never beaten the games, but yeah, there was a Great War. Anyway, uh, and what I love about this Floet is its flower. It's Doomsday-like flower that resembles the machine that AZ fired off. They pretty much nuked Kalos in the entire world, but hey, uh, this Floet is actually obtainable in your world. It does naturally spawn. There are ways to acquire and we're going to get into that today. So if you guys have been enjoying the Pixelmon content channel or excited for another guide, smash the like button, show support, consider subscribing if you're new. And let's hop right into this. Starting off with the fact that we are in Pixelmon version 9.0.10 and Minecraft version 1.16.5. If for whatever reason the guide, the information on how to get this Floet changes in the future, keep in mind this is what version we are in. Now, first off... Uh, Eternal Flower Floet, it spawns in a bunch of biomes. I'll have them all listed on screen as I read them off. First and foremost, it can spawn in any flowery biome in Morning. The flowery biome consists of the flower force and sunflower plants for vanilla. If you have biomes of plenty installed, it can be the bamboo, the bamboo blossom grove, the cherry blossom grove, the flower meadow, the lavender field, the origin valley. For biomes, you'll go if you have that installed. You can use the aluminum fields, the Amaranth Fields, Amaranth Fields, sorry, uh, Cherry Blossom Clearing, Cherry Blossom Forest, Flowering Ancient Forest, Flowering Enchanted Grove, Flowering Grove, Flowering Meadow, and Rose Fields. And if you have the Terraforge mod installed, you can use Flower Plains as well. So a lot of options for this guy spawning in the flower biomes, but I'm not done. It also has a magical category, so it can spawn in any magical biomes. Um, and those only exist in biomes of plenty and biomes should go. So I won't read them all off, but on screen right now is a picture of all those biomes that are counted as well. So it has a bunch of options for biomes wise that it can spawn in if you have all those biomes installed. Now it spawns it morning in all those biomes under the condition of sweet sense. So for those that don't know, sweet scent is actually a move that certain Pokemon can learn in Pixamon, and you have to use that move to uh, cause this Pokemon to spawn. I'm not entirely sure what else the specifics are because I'll I'll have in the uh, description the wiki link to the sweet sweet scent page as well so you guys can read up on that but it just has list all the Pokemon that can know the move. So I'm assuming you just use it as an external move. And yeah, it does say it can be used as an external move. So yeah, just use Sweet Scent when you enter any of these biomes. And it has an ultra rare chance of appearing. So it will be extremely rare. But once you encounter it, it will be something worth collecting in your Pixamon journey. Because this is a canon Pokemon. This is something that actually exists. It's not like a Pixamon made up thing. This is actually something worth collecting and using. Um... Because, not that the others aren't, but I'm just saying, like, this is crucial to the Pokemon storyline, the lore, and it's a very cool Pokemon to actually be able to get in your Pixelmon world as an encounter, an extremely rare encounter at that. But yeah, um, I recommend it a lot. Uh, you guys can let me know in the comment section down below if you yourself have been able to capture the Eternal Flower Flow. Because you are still going to have to battle and capture it. Honestly, this thing is worth a Master Ball in my opinion. But maybe you could use the Ancient Pokeballs on it since it is a old creature, an immortal one at that. But yeah, that is going to do it for this Pixelmon Guide and how to capture the Eternal Flower Flow. Once more, you are going to have to find yourself any of the Flower Biomes or Magical Biomes if you have other mods installed that at biomes to your world and you're going to want to use sweet scent in those biomes to have a chance of encountering the eternal flower flowette and guys that is going to do it for this guide i hope it was helpful to you all let me know in the comment section down below if you yourself have captured the eternal flower flowette or if you're hunting for one and that's going to do it for this guide i hope you all enjoyed hope you all have a great day stay safe everyone goodbye